happy Sunday to you. This is Gina up here in northern Minnesota at Stars Touch Heartfelt Healing. So I learned so much yesterday at the expo and I'll have to share those things with you later. We're getting hit with a blizzard I feel like. These poor birds up here don't know what they're supposed to do. They come out for the springtime and then bam we get hit with snow. All right, I pulled a card, it just flew out of there, so I'm gonna throw it in here. A spiritual abundance. I started to uh, sh just go for it with the angel card reading and <clears throat> right away, spiritual abundance falls out in the snow. So that's the card. <laughs> Not gonna be taking a lot of time today with this going on, my goodness. All right, spiritual abundance. The angels want you to know that they're supporting you in all areas of your life. Follow your spiritual guidance and intuitive feelings and they'll bring you abundance in all areas. Abundance is your spiritual reward for trusting and sharing your gifts, talents, and light with the world. Any material needs you have will be met at this time and you are being encouraged to surrender any of your concerns in this area of your life to heaven. Allow the angels to take care of them for you. You are, being, you are a being of abundance. You are abundant in light, energy, and love. And you are being encouraged to share this in every area of your life. Instead of asking what you need to ask of yourself, how can I be of service? When, do you, when, do, when you do so, you align with yourself and the universal life force and it will take care of everything for you. There is a flow of support coming to you at this time and those who dedicate themselves to service will receive the abundance of God and his angels. So yes, yesterday I met so many wonderful people with different um, things. The yoga, the yoga lady from End of the Road Yoga up in Ely, oh my gosh, I learned so much from her. I've been saying chakra and it's supposed to be chakra. So I'm going to have to practice that. I've been doing that for what, 700 videos? Take a little habit to break there, huh? <laughs> and the angel card reading. Sorry if I'm going fast, but I'm telling you, it's 25 degrees and slippery on the roads, etc. Oh, and that's neat. Spiritual growth. It's all about spiritual growth and spiritual abundance right now. So let's see what it says. Spiritual growth. Every experience is a learning experience. You're a student of life and spirit, and what has happened in your life hasn't happened to you, it's happened for you. You have incredible resilience and the capacity to overcome whatever darkness or unknown you face. No matter what has been served to you, you have done everything within your might and power to face it and find a way forward. Angels are acknowledging your determination and positive, kind-hearted, upbeat energy that has allowed you to become the wonderful person you are today. You may feel that your spiritual gifts are opening much more at this time. Be aware of any visions, psychic insights, or connections you develop as they will be pivotal to your growth. They were just talking about that yesterday too, is how we have to be thankful for all the good things that come in and then also all the things that are lessons because once we learn our lessons, we can share it with others. Today we have the sun in Aries and the moon in Pisces, which is kind of a dreamlike activity. So you can surely just sit in front of the TV and watch movies all day, but you could also get out a journal and start just making notes of what you really like about yourself, what you can share with others, and what your plans are for moving forward. Or clutter clear, because we're still in the full moon energy as well. That's what I'm gonna do, is start going through the house and getting rid of more stuff. So I hope you have a wonderful day. I love you and I'll be back again tomorrow.